Hey everyone, Lewis here, and I thought I'd bring some recent news related to Pokemon Go. If you like this video, please hit the like button. Be sure to subscribe to the channel and hit the bell for alerts of when I upload new content to the channel. Especially those with disabilities similar to mine. Happy New Year. Happy 2023. This is the first new video of the new year. And... Niantic has announced a couple of things that will be going over. And we're going to start with... Larvitar Community Day Classic with the original Larvitar Community Day being in June of 2018 and of course just like the original Larvitar Community Day you'll be able to catch its shiny form Tyranitar will be able to learn the move Smackdown but with one major difference unlike the original Larvitar Community Day Larvitar Community Day Classic will have a special research story for about one dollar or equal equivalent currency you'll be able to not only buy the tickets for this but you'll also be able to gift them to friends if you are great friends or higher and the event bonuses for this are three times XP for catching Pokemon both incense and lures will last about three hours, and you'll be able to take up to five photobomb encounters involving Larvitar. In other Pokemon news, also announced this week by Niantic, is the Twinkling Fantasy event, which is a dragon and fairy type event. Mega Salamence will be making its debut into Mega Raids. The event bonuses for this involves making nice, great, or excellent throws, which the bonuses include two times XP for making those throws successfully, increased chance for level 31 and, and higher trainers to receive XL candies and additional candy for making those said throws. The Pokemon you'll be able to catch in the wild include Clefairy, Clefable, Jigglypuff, Dratini, Togetic, Meryl, Rolts, Vibria, Bagon, Dino, Dedende, Gumi, and Noibat. The following Pokemon that you'll be able to catch as shinies include Clefairy, Jigglypuff, Dratini, Togetic, Meryl, Rolts, Bagon, Dino, the Dende, and Noibat. And you'll also be able to have a photo bombing encounter with one of the following Pokemon that will be appearing during this event. There will also be a collection challenge, which you'll be able to earn Mega Salamance energies and a charged TM as well as a fast TM. For field research task encounters, the following Pokemon include Clefairy, Dratini, Bagon, and Detende, as well as Gumi. For one star raids, Jigglypuff, Meryl, Axew, and Dino. For three star raids, Mawile, Dredgeon, and Detende. Zekrom will also be in five star raids, and don't forget Mega Salamence in Mega Raids. Zekrom will have the move Fusion Bolt. One more thing. If you notice this new format, that's because I decided to make these videos even better and reformat my Pokemon Go News videos. As I was inspired by a recent project I've been working on using Cabana, and that's what I'm also using for this and all future Pokemon Go news videos. And I'm slowly regaining the strength to eventually want to stream on Twitch again. But mainly because of mental health and life. Thanks for watching everyone. You can also follow me on Instagram, Twitch, Facebook and TikTok. Remember, 
It's time for adventure!